Well, good morning, everybody. This is Capri in Final Fantasy XIV, A Realm Reborn. Here to show you what I did over the past few days to make some gill on my alt. The first thing I tackled was boar hide. I farmed the wild boars out in the East Shroud. Um, they're, they make a triangle from positions 1825 to 1422 to 1721. Combined with aluminum, this makes boar leather. And this is what I consider as a staple item, and I really suspect prices will increase when new classes are introduced. Everything in this video, I'm, I uh, I farmed for 30 minutes, and I basically used a uh, cheap buff food as a timer, basically. The second thing that I went to get was uh, northern pike. Northern pike is a fish that is used by culinarians to make stuffed cabbage, and you can fish it up at the nail in Korthos. And this is at position 1621. Now here's the key to catch the optimal number of northern pike, you need to use top water frog as bait. And while I was fishing here, I also picked up a Time Warden leather map, which, you know, I sold it for about, I think it was 4,000. I'll, I'll put, out, put down the exact numbers in the description below. The third thing that I went after was Alamegan Mustard. This can be farmed in eastern Thanalan, right outside of Camp Drybone, and it's at position 1520 and around there. And uh, this is used by culinarians to make deviled eggs. Deviled eggs is, you know, it's not the best raid food out there, but a lot of people still use it because of uh, specific numbers or whatever. After Alamegan Mustard, I farmed Electrum Ore, which, which is in Upper Lanasia at, at around position 3024. This is an item that was a little bit high for my character's level, because she's not a 50 miner yet. So, um... I didn't get the number that I was hoping for during my 30 minutes of farming, but I still got a beefy amount and got and I gained a level as well. Even as a level 50 miner, you can you can use this item as uh, a way to complete your challenge log for the week to get that 2,000 I think it is uh, gill for completing the challenge. And after Electrum Ore, I I decided to farm shards. I uh, I, I went with the ones that were right outside of Ulda because you know that's where I hearth to or I use Return to go to and I farmed wind, lightning, fire, and water. And the thing I want to say about shard farming that, are, that you know people don't talk about in other videos is don't forget to, u to use your wards. These increase yield by two per swing and use on nodes with you know the plus one gathering attempts. So in preparation for this video, I farmed for a total of about four hours and I, uh, I looted 148,000 gil from my first retainer and 94,000 gil from my second retainer for a grand total of 242,000 gil gained over the past couple days. Alright everybody, I would like to thank you all for watching my video and thank you to all of my subscribers and everybody who, have, who has viewed my videos in the past. I would really like to thank you. Oh my goodness. I never expected to go this far. And uh, please tune in in a couple more days for another quick gill farm.